island of Cuba lies only 90 miles from the United States. A colony of Spain since 1492, Cuba exported sugar, fruit, and tobacco to the United States and the rest of the world. American investors by 1880 had spent millions of dollars in Cuba. In Cuba itself, movements for independence from Spain had a very long history. By 1880, the Cuban insurrection had become a crisis for the Spanish government. On January 28, 1898, the USS Maine entered Havana Harbor in Cuba. The Maine was one of four state-of-the-art battleships in the growing U.S. fleet. The ship was a great source of pride and a symbol of America's increasing world influence. President William McKinley ordered the Maine into Havana, but just why he sent it is unclear. Some argue McKinley saw the order as part of normal diplomatic exchange with Spain. Others argue McKinley wanted to encourage the Cuban rebels and demoralize the Spanish. McKinley may also have wanted to protect American property from both the Spanish and the rebels. On February 15th, the Maine exploded, a devastating blast that ripped the ship's hull apart. The Maine quickly sank. 266 Americans died in the explosion and fire, or drowned. Across the country, Americans asked, in public and private, who sank the Maine? Three months later, the United States declared war on Spain and began massing troops for an invasion of Cuba. The invasion began in late June 1898. Your task is to figure out why.